Opposition protests in Lok Sabha against price rise, Prime Minister meets key ministers amid parliament disruptions. Prime Minister Narendra Modi on Friday held a meeting with his key ministers in Parliament House to formulate government strategy amid continued protests by opposition members in both houses of Parliament. Defence Minister Rajnath Singh, Home Minister Amit Shah, Parliamentary Affairs Minister Pralhad Joshi and Information and Broadcasting Minister Anurag Thakur were among those present at the meeting. The proceedings of both the houses have been disrupted since the commencement of monsoon session due to protests by opposition MPs mainly on price rise, hike in GST and alleged misuse of central agencies. Both Lok Sabha and Rajya Sabha were disrupted minutes after the houses reconvened on Friday. Rajya Sabha Chairman M. Venkaya Naidu refused to admit notices given by a number of opposition members including leader of opposition Malikarjun Kharge over price rise, hike in GST, alleged misuse of central agencies and Agnipat scheme of recruitment in the armed forces. Opposition members have so far continued to raise their demands to suspend the business and take up the issues raised by them. On Thursday, Rajya Sabha Deputy Chairman Harivansh managed to conduct question hour amid protest by Congress MPs over questioning of Sonia Gandhi by A.D. The disruptions in Parliament have been debated even out in the open on Friday with Joshi and Congress leader Jairam Ramesh locking horns on Twitter. Yet again the Modi Sarkar refused an urgent debate in the Rajya Sabha on galloping price rise and senseless increase on GST rates on food items. House adjourned till 12 noon. The opposition is united that we want debate on this critical issue impacting crores of Indians, Congress MP Jairam Ramesh tweeted. FM Nirmala Sitharaman has to be present in the house, listen to member of all the parties, their demands and respond. Can't they wait till FM recovers? Is it not basic courtesy? Congress has habit of lying and spreading misinformation. Jayaram Ramesh is continuing this legacy, responded Pralhad Joshi on Twitter. On Friday, the government said in the house as well that Sitharaman has been down with COVID-19 and the opposition should wait till she recovers. The ongoing monsoon session assumes significance not only for election of the president and vice president but for the important government legislative business. Before the start of the session, the government said that various departments have indicated to present 32 bills in parliament during the current session and 14 of them are ready and have already been discussed by standing committees of parliament. The monsoon session of Parliament commenced on July 18 and it will continue till August 12. Lok Sabha disrupted over price rise. The Lok Sabha was disrupted again on Friday as opposition MPs continued to protest against rise in GST of some items, and continuing price rise. Opposition's protests started soon after the House met, and several MPs trooped near the Speaker's podium showing placards, and raising slogans. Speaker continued the question hour amid sloganeering for some time. There is an important question being asked. This house is not for showing placards or raising slogans. You can do that outside, Speaker said. Parliamentary Affairs Minister Pralha Joshi said Finance Minister Nirmala Sitaraman is recovering from Covid, and the debate on price rise will be held when she is back. You agreed in the BAC. They are asking for a discussion on price rise, we are ready for it. They can also raise their issues in the zero hour. They don't want to ask questions, they don't want to pass bills, they don't even want to hold debates. Majority of the MPs want the question hour to run, Joshi said slamming the opposition. They are depriving the rights of the members. I condemn this attitude. Government is ready for discussion after FM comes back. They are belittling the house, he said. As protests continued, the house was a Jew, 